The parliamentary procedure was created to keep organizations running in a smooth and efficient manner. Parliamentary procedure is defined as a code of ethics to be followed by individuals in a group to conduct business or meetings. Parliamentary procedure is unique to the democratic process. To learn parliamentary procedure is to learn democracy, allowing majority rule while giving the minority their say. We hope that this video will enable you to be involved in the decisions of your club and other organizations who you may be a member of. The guide most commonly associated with parliamentary procedure is Robert's Rules of Order. Before an organized meeting can occur, there should be an agenda. An agenda is the order of business for a specific meeting. The agenda should include the following call to order, roll call, minutes, treasurer's report, committee reports including standing committees and special committees, unfitness business, new business, and adjournment. Call to order is done by the president to bring the meeting to order. Roll calls are used to the term quorums, which should be f at least 51% of members present, and majorities by those attending the meetings. Minutes are the recorded transactions by the secretary from the previous meeting. Minutes are usually distributed electronically prior to the meeting to save the time of reading them out loud. The president will call for the approval of the previous meeting's minutes before continuing the meeting. Treasurer's reports are given by the treasurer. These reports are of the financial transactions of the club since the previous meeting. This information requires no vote and is for information only. Unfinished business is business which was not completed at the last regular meeting. New business is exactly that. New business put before the group for their attention and vote. Usually, new business should be on the agenda. However, any member may bring up any new business if recognized by the chair. To adjourn is to formally end the meeting. The main motion. The purpose of a main motion is to introduce business to the group. A main motion is debatable amendable, and requires a majority vote. Debatable means the motion can be discussed, pro, and con. Amendable means the motion can be changed. Majority means more than half of the now votes cast. What is the first item of business? Mr. President? Yes, Your Honor. I move that we participate in getting pizza for lunch during our next meeting. A second is required for a main motion to show that another person wishes the motion to be considered. I second that motion. It is properly moved and seconded that we participate in getting pizza for lunch during our next fellows meeting. Is there any discussion? The president will ask for debate or discussion once the motion has been properly moved and seconded. An individual wishing to discuss a motion must gain recognition from the chair. President? Yes, Gladys. Uh, I'm in favor of this motion because we can get the pizza in 30 minutes. Thank you. Is there any further discussion? Mr. President? Yes, Logan. I oppose this motion because pizza is full of carbs. Thank you. Is there any further discussion? All right, seeing none, we should have a vote. <clears throat> so all those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. All opposed, please say nay. When asking for the opposition, the president may ask for a negative response, such as no or nay, in the event of an on-voice vote. However, on a show of hands, the president may ask for the same sign. Nay. No. The ayes have it. The motion carries. We will participate in pizza for lunch. Now let's add another step. We're going to amend the main motion. In amendment, is used to modify the main motion. First, you must have a main motion so that there is something to amend. A second is required for an amendment to show that another member 
wishes the motion to be considered. Amendments are also debatable, amendable, and require a majority vote. What is the first item of business? Mr. President? Yes, Yvonne. I move that we participate in getting pizza for lunch during our next wellness meeting. I second that motion. It has been properly moved and seconded that we get pizza for lunch. During discussion or debate of the main motion, an amendment may be proposed. Mr. President? Yes, Yvonne. I move to amend the main motion by, say, by adding words from Mr. Caesar. I second that amendment. It has been properly moved and seconded that we amend the main motion by inserting the words from Little Caesars. Is there any discussion? Mr. President. Yes, Logan. I would strongly oppose this amendment because I think Little Caesars is garbage pizza and Papa John's is far superior. Thank you. Is there any further discussion? Mr. President. Yes, Glennis. We have to get Little Caesars because it's very cheap. Thank you. Is there any further discussion? Seeing none, we should have a vote and on the amendment <clears throat> to the main motion. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. All opposed, please say nay. Nay. The motion carries. The motion currently on the floor is to get Little Caesars for lunch during our next fellows meeting. Is there any discussion? Seeing none, we should have a vote. All those in favor of the amended main motion, please signify by saying aye. Aye. All opposed, please say nay. Nay. Motion carries. We shall get Little Caesars for lunch. Once an amendment passes, it becomes part of the main motion. The main motion has been modified. You have learned about a main motion and amending a main motion. In some cases, it may be necessary to delay action on an item of business until more information can be gathered. There are two ways to do this. The first is to lay on the table, to postpone taking any action until a later time. This motion requires a second and a majority vote. The motion to lay on the table is not amendable or debatable. Is there any new business? Mr. President? Yes, Your Honor. I hope that we participate in getting pizza for lunch during our next fellows meeting. I second that motion. It has been properly moved and seconded that we get pizza for lunch. Is there any discussion? Mr. President? Yes, Logan. Since Vincent loves pizza a lot, I move to table the motion that we get pizza for lunch until he is present to provide additional input. A second is required to table the motion. I second to table that motion. Now that it has been properly moved and seconded that we table that motion to participate in getting pizza for lunch, we should take a vote. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. Opposed, say nay. Motion carries. This motion has been tabled. Is there any further new business? Before a motion could be taken from the table, another item of business must be transacted. Mr. President? Yes, Yvonne. I move that we change the remaining location to room 105 next month. Now, do you recognize this as a main motion? It is. I second that motion. It has been properly moved and seconded that we change our meeting place next month to room 105. Is there any discussion? Mr. President? Yes, Logan. We should move our meeting place because this room will be available next month. Thank you. Is there any further discussion? Seeing none, we should take a vote. All in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 <clears throat> All opposed, please say nay. Motion carries. We, sh we will hold our next meeting in room 105. Is there any more new business? Mr. President? Yes, Glennis. Since Vincent just walked in the door, I move to take from the table the motion to get pizza for lunch. Thank you. Is there a second? I second that motion. Okay. Now that it's been properly moved and seconded that we take from the table the motion to get pizza for lunch, we should vote. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 <clears throat> All opposed, please say nay. Motion carries. The motion currently on the floor is to get pizza for lunch. Is there any discussion? Mr. President? Yes, Vincent. I vote we get pizza for lunch because it's very economical. Thank you. Is there any further discussion? Seeing none, it's time to vote. 
All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. Aye. All opposed, please say nay. Motion carries. We will get pizza for lunch. Is there any more new business? To adjourn is to formally end the meeting. The motion to adjourn requires a second, is not debatable, and is not amendable. Adjourning a meeting requires a majority vote. Mr. President? Yes, you are. I move to adjourn this meeting. I second that motion. Now that it has been properly moved and seconded that we adjourn this meeting, we should take a vote. All those in favor, please signify by saying aye. 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 All opposed, please say nay. Motion carries. This meeting is adjourned. The motions presented in this video are the most common motions in parliamentary procedure. They provide a foundation on which parliamentary procedure skills may be built. For further information, we recommend reviewing some of the documents Dr. Linger made. Thank you.